there, but you can't take them. Some parents have started calling them an Uber or a Lyft ride. But Valley News Team's Nishay Taylor talked to a local rideshare driver about why that may not be such a good idea. Corey Eslinger, an Uber driver, says he has received a few requests from parents to drive their kids to places like school and other activities. A lot of times it was uh, the 14, 15, 16 year olds. As a father himself, he says he understands the struggle of getting kids around town. How, how much of a hassle it was to get them back and forth from doing things, um, work, uh, different events, school events. But he warns against it. Actually, he says under the terms and conditions for both Uber and Lyft, anyone under the age of 18 isn't allowed to ride alone. We posed a question on our Facebook page to find out if other drivers were having the same experience. One driver says she received a request to pick up a seven-year-old and an infant. As Linger says, for both the driver and passenger, there are risks associated with accepting these kinds of ride requests. He says not only is there the chance for the minor to get into the wrong vehicle, but also the driver could be at fault if an accident happens. That would put them at greater risk if they would get in an accident that um, Uber and Lyft wouldn't cover the additional damages or even their own insurance. Eslinger recommends that drivers use their discretion and to reject requests to drive unaccompanied minors. It's, it's really not worth it. In Fargo, Nishay Taylor, Valley News Live.